Many of us choose to wear our hair in protective styles to retain length, to gain length, or to give our hair a break. However, proper maintenance and preparation is key when you're going into protective mode. Whether you're protecting your hair with braids, weaves, or wigs, from this video, I demonstrate a few techniques that I use when I'm going into protective mode, what I do while I'm in protective mode, and what I do when I'm coming out of protective mode. So stay tuned for this video. So whether I'm wearing braids, weave, or a wig, I shampoo and deeply condition my hair. I base my hair with my oil of choice. And last, I apply a good leave-in and a moisturizer. So once I'm in protective mode, especially the first few days, I tend to saturate my edges and sides very well. At this age, I want to preserve as much hairline as I possibly can. Treating my edges is vital when I am wearing a wig. The lining of the wig and the wig cap can cause breakage around your edges. I am at liberty to say that I have experience from wearing wigs and not properly taking care of my hairline that I experience hairline breakage. So now that I'm in protective mode, whether I'm wearing a wig or a weave, I basically saturate the hair with my hair lotion to keep it moisturized. But when I'm in braid mode, I tend to keep my hair moisturized with my hair lotion as well, with some braid spray or some mocha mist, or I like to use my rosemary water in the summertime. Coming out of protective mode is the best, as I am excited to see how my hair has progressed. During my last five days of protective mode, I generally do the greenhouse effect. I can care less how the style looks anymore. It is old, the wig is old, the weave is tangled. I pretty much over moisturize my hair to ensure a less headache when I am removing braids or a weave. This is my hair coming out of protective mode. It is very much moisturized. It is not too dry or brittle, but soft and easy to manage. Now I am off to wash and deep condition my hair for my next set look. So this video was made to stress the importance of prepping your hair and maintaining your hair while you're in protective mode. I will never forget the day almost 25 years ago when I went into an African braid shop to get those Janet Jackson braids that she wore in the movie Poet of Justice. As I sat in the chair to get my hair braided, I thought to myself, they're not even going to wash my hair. From that experience alone, it has taught me to always prep my hair when I'm going into protective mode. So I just wanted to share those techniques with anyone who's viewing this video to always prep your hair and take care of your hair while you're in protective mode because nobody else is. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please rate it, comment, and I welcome all new subscribers. And thanks for viewing this video.